spell to bring it all together and make sure that you know the the enemy team is definitely disabled. I think that's what Lua's gonna be looking for here. Try and lock down the golf as Ferrari gets a couple of clicks in there. Telekines is back onto the cliff as Mu is forced to level up Blink to get the bounty rune. Faith though caught in the spin and that's gonna be first blood going the way of newbie. Chuan, Chuan. He wanted to get some right-click face boots and Mask Man has picked up, so he can go back into the jungle and keep his farm efficiency flowing like that. But right now, he's not even reaching level 6. He's been sharing experience with two supports. They've not been stacking or pulling. Sure, he's shut down burning a hell of a lot. Looking at the net worth, he's burning is up 2.5k. He's a good thousand behind Rabbit, but oh man. They went for it mid, I missed it. Faith goes down, but the return kill there from Ferrari takes out the Witch Doctor. For a second, I thought they killed Ferrari, but it's only it's only the Ancient Apparition now. Omni Slash Burning taken out! Rabbit hits level 6, gets the Omni down, and no creeps to save him. For this, Yubi have to finish this so quickly, or they're going to lose their base at the same time. And I think IG's just trying to buy some time for Burning to be able to take off top. Uh, Newbie aren't doing this quite fast oh. enough. Are IG waiting for Newbie to kill it? And then going to fight, Ice Blast going to launch, Rabbit does pick up Aegis Immortal, but here comes the damage strike, 3 man Ice Blast! The Queen of Pain does blink out, but that's it! Requiem down and two people dead, Rabbit! Uh, man, oh, he managed to get his Omni Slash out, got a little bit of lag there with, uh, with the Chinese service, Sonic Wave onto Ferrari, the Life Strike Array, not going to catch anyone, but Rabbit against the DD of Ferrari, there's no escaping that, and take a look at Tom, burning! One versus one against June's Tidehunter. There's another kill that happens down at bot, but this this tier three. That's the important thing. In that team fight, and Burning didn't even have to show up. All he does is pressure the map. And in terms of net worth, he's overtaking the Queen of Pain and well, the Rabbit Chill to the BKB Ferrari. They'll still Omni Slash him with the mech. Now turn back. Requiem just oh, about Rabbit. launch! Rabbit gets obliterated! Ferrari takes him out, now Burning comes in, the Ice Blast trail still on to that poor old Tidehunter as Lena tries the last ditch, Life Strike Array, but three, four, four heroes down for new- Oh, if that had landed, that was 100% dead quap. They have to be so careful now that uh, this Rubik actually picks it up and Banana's going down for sure. June blinks forward, but he's still got no Ravage. Chuan, okay, forfeit your life. Witch Doctor for, uh, for a Rubik trade is- uh... Of it kind of gets limited and- they have to be so careful about this Morphling, who's 3, 0, and 10. Just has godly farm right now for the type of hero that he is. And the smoke newbie. pops. They know someone's here. Lua blink forward. Adapter strike onto June, so we can't ravage. That's four and a half seconds. He's down four. Ice blast. Yep, see yep. He's gone. And with Mu, trying to battle it up with Luo here. Still burning on the hunt. Sunsheng, Necroinus will take him down as Banana. Critted once, stunned up, and with three hits, he's down. Rabbit and Mu, the last one standing. And with these two cores, they've got no Ravage, no stuns, no support. You gotta see that Durka, like, lifted his arms up. It was adorable, but... Yeah, what's he gonna build right now that impacts anything? Like, it, it's not on him uh, at this point that will really change anything. And Burning drops his quality. It's kind of one or the other. You go in without them, and then respawn and use them. Or you use them and then die, and then you're sort of feeling, well, I shouldn't really have done that. So, uh, Ferrari gets the chance to sit up on high ground pretty freely. While Burning sits in the back line, just waiting. Waiting for Newbie to blink Ravage. Where actually is... June the Tidehunter over on the side, hiding in the trees, waiting for his moment to strike, but tier 3 has already fallen. Ferrari still there, BKB already popped, there we go, Requiem now, Rabbit has a BKB of his own, as Luo is looking for the stun down, Burning is sitting on the back lines, shapeshift up, and oh man, June, where did June's HP go? Ice Blast will take out Banana, that's it, Nubi are down and out, IG demolish Rax, chilling touch and howl, that's it, game over, Nubi. Get 2 0 here by IG in the ESL 1 Chinese qualifiers for Frankfurt this year. And that game looked a lot smoother for IG. They just took the game and ran with it. Didn't really give maybe the best opportunity to come back. And like you said, in terms of the laning phase, I mean, things went pretty well for Newbie. Like, their top lane, it was an advantageous lane. The Tidehunter really got farmed. Like, we were talking about how insane this farm was, right? Like, he had a 9 minute 40 second.